Hello everyone, my name is Janelle Guyan and I am the Education Coordinator for West Basin Municipal Water District. I am very excited to announce the 2021 Water is Life Student Art Contest. This art contest encourages 3rd through 12th grade students in the West Basin Service Area to create water smart pieces of art that inspires their community to save water. We encourage all eligible students to participate by creating a piece of art that follows the Water is Life theme and depicts how water is a precious resource. All artwork must be created on an 8.5 by 11 sheet of paper with a 1 inch border all around. Submissions are accepted starting now until Friday, March 19th. You have two options to submit your artwork to our contest. The first option is to mail your artwork in a flat box to our office in the city of Carson. The second option is to take a high quality photo or scan of your artwork and email it to me at janelle at westbasin.org. If you do choose to email me your artwork submissions, please make sure to hold on to the original copy until our winners are selected in April. Whichever way that you choose to submit your artwork, all submissions must include a parent or guardian signed entry form. 15 total winners or five in each elementary, middle, and high school grade level categories will be selected by our judges in April. All winners will receive a brand new Apple iPad with the three grand prize winners also receiving a stylus and a $25 gift card. Now that we're introduced to our art contest, let's take a look at some do's and don'ts of the Water is Life Student Art Contest. Do make sure to draw your artwork horizontally on an eight and a half by 11 piece of paper with a one inch border all around. To place a one inch border along the edges of your eight and a half by 11 sheet of paper, take a ruler and mark at one inch along each corner of the paper. You should have eight total marks. Use a ruler to connect lines along each edge of the paper. Repeat this until you have four lines and the one inch border. You will be drawing in the six and a half by nine inch middle area that you have created. Do not draw vertically or without a one inch border around your artwork. Do make sure that all submissions, whether mailed or emailed, include a completed parent guardian permission form, just like this one. Do make sure that you have large, simple artwork. This helps make sure that our judges can understand what you're displaying on your piece of art. Do make sure to have a clear water slogan that's not necessarily water is life. This one says, water is our future. Do make sure that all of your artwork is completely original. Make sure that no family or friends are helping you complete your artwork and that you're not copying trademarked or copyrighted characters like Mickey Mouse or SpongeBob. Make sure that you do not copy any artwork from the images I'm showing you or from past winners of this art contest. If you are going to mail your submission to our office in Carson, do make sure that you are not folding or rolling your piece of artwork when you mail it in. This makes sure that the artwork is not damaged in the mailing process. Do make sure that your submissions have clear and contrasting colors. This makes sure that our judges can clearly see what you're trying to display on your piece of art. Remember, the deadline for our art contest is Friday, March 19th. Please be sure to stay tuned for our bi-weekly Art Tip Tuesdays where you can learn how to create an award-winning piece of art for this contest. 